Fare bella figura. Make a good impression. Be a sharp-dressed man. Hi, my name is Greg Story. I'm the president of Dale Carnegie Tokyo Training. I run my own soft skills training franchise business here in Tokyo. Many years ago, I decided to dress for success. Each day, I consult my schedule. And that day's work content drives my sartorial choices. Before I head out the door every day, I check myself in the mirror and I ask, do I look like one of the most professional people in my industry? Now, this day I attended the British Chamber event at Tokyo Midtown, elevating workplace engagement, mastering human-centered communication. As usual, I was there networking, looking for clients, but this event title attracted a positive horde of ravenous recruiters, all looking for clients too. As a result, there weren't any actual clients in the room. So a disappointing result. I've had the same issue with rooms full of recruiters at the uh, American Chamber of it, so they must all be in fierce competition for clients. I had a client meeting in the late afternoon in super cool Nakadori in Matanuchi. I've been chasing this client for months. And for various reasons, we have never been able to get together to complete the follow-on from the first discussion we had about their training needs back in December 2023. I won the deal for two very significant programs. That was a good result and worth the wait. Now, this particular evening, <clears throat> I attended an event at the Tokyo American Club hosted by the NRW, North Rhine, Westphalia, global office in the form of a business fireplace talk with the title Creating Success Stories, Innovation and Growth, Germany and Japan in Challenging Times. The panelists were well-known local economists, Jesper Kohl, the new head or the new boss of NRW Global here in Japan, Carolina Kawakubo, and outgoing NRW Global head, George Lua. Now, Jesper, as usual, was an absolutely brilliant form, absolutely fantastic form as a speaker, and really worked the audience. I actually referenced him as a model in my book, Japan Presentations Mastery, and he's been a guest on my podcast, Japan's Top Business Interviews, episode number 87. Now, Carolina is the new boss and public representative. Her public speaking skills were very professional, so I'm sure she'll be a tremendous asset to NRW Global in Japan. She's also been a guest on my podcast, Japan's Top Business Interviews, episode number 19, when she was president of Medskin Solutions. Now, George is an old friend of mine. We met in 2001 at a high-tech uh, high tech study group meeting. Now, this is a group full of serious, well-educated Japan experts, all with many decades of experience. This is a very high-level group led by Glenn Fukushima, who is also another total legend here. Glenn was my guest on Japan's Top Business Interviews, episode number 36. George has been doing his investment and trade promotion role for the last 17 years. I've been in Japan 39 years and George 38, so he is a real Japan hand. George was my guest on my podcast, Japan's Top Business Interviews, episode number 83, and had many insights to share. When we did the podcast, I found we had so many things in common with our experiences in Japan. This was his farewell party and brought a lot of good networking opportunities because George is very well connected. I wanted something a little conservative for the British Chamber event, the client meeting and the evening networking event. The subtle blue in the broad pinstripe in the suit was not competing with the butcher's light blue and white stripe in the shirt. To add a bit of flair and stand out in the dark suited crowd, I added my Amalfi series pocket square from Massimo Pironi to bring some colour to the outfit. I chose my custom dark grey suit. The wool fabric was woven by Marling and Evans, 1782. It has a broad spaced light blue pinstripe, notch lapels, double pleats, double cuffs, side vents, flat pockets, over the calf black socks. Summary, custom, butcher's light blue and white striped shirt with white French cuffs and white collar. Collar stays by Kirby Allison. Navy blue tie by Franz Spada, tied with a double Windsor knot. Pocket square by Massimo Pironi from his Amalfi series and reverse puff. Corporate badge by Dale Carnegie. Gold 40mm Versace watch with 
the Medusa motif, custom new brick, a new back, I should say, alligator cobalt blue strap by Jean Rousseau, Montblanc black and gold pen, Lonvon business card holder. Shoes are high shine black Polini calf skin leather derby wingtips with Balmoral stitching and decorative broguing on the medallion tied with a Parisian knot. This photograph is taken outside my office as we are running day two of our leadership training for managers class in the Mochizuka room, that day where I normally take the shots for Fare Bella Fugida. If you want to accelerate your proficiency in leadership, communication, sales, presentations, or diversity, equity, and inclusion, there's only one place operating the highest level. That is Dale Cunningham Turkey Training. And you can find out more about us and the attachments with this video.